Hi, I'm Kevin, a speech language pathologist here at Super Duper, and this is Go for the Dough. Uh, Go for the Dough is one of our best selling and popular vocabulary games of word meanings. Um, what we do here is we work with students that are preschool and up, so it can be any age level or any uh, class that you're working with, and we're going to work on uh, enhancing those skills of word recall, uh, just giving definitions, uh, also semantic flexibility as far as using multiple meaning words, and then also phonemic awareness skills as in rhyming. So uh, how do we do that? Well, the students, as you see here, have a game board that's going to be based around delivering pizzas. They're going to deliver pizzas over to grandma's house, and along the way, each time they deliver a pizza, they're going to earn some of these super duper dough dollars, and they're going to have these to collect each time they deliver that pizza successfully. Um, the biggest thing that we want to work on is what area of vocabulary and word meaning do we want to target? Well, in this game, you'll notice we have six different color-coded Super Dough Dollars that each target a different area. These are going to include uh, synonyms, opposites, rhyming words. Also, we have categories, definitions, and as well as multiple meaning words. With these, what we're going to do is decide what skill we're working on. If we're working on definitions, for example, we'll select a definition card. And you'll notice here at the top it's going to be labeled. It's going to provide a picture and as well as the word at the bottom. So for definitions with this one, what is a flag? The student will then provide that appropriate response. Each time they respond, they're going to take the card and they're going to put that super dough dollar into the middle. That's kind of like their bank. The students will then take the die. They will roll. Here, for instance, is a four. They will take their little car, one, two, three, four, and they're going to work their way over to grandma's house to deliver that pizza. Once they've done that, they reach in the middle and they collect all the dollars. These are for them to keep, and they, of course, will continue to play the game. Next student responds, and they will put their dollars in the center of the board as well. Uh, some of the examples here, say this is for rhyming words. This is a rhyming word for bed. The student will then respond with the appropriate rhyming word for bed. Um, here's multiple meaning, for example, cook. This is cook, shows a pot that's cooking the food. What is another uh, meaning for that word cook? Here's one with definition for hamburger. They will provide the definition. For example, here is opposites. This one, of course, is loud. So what would the opposite of loud be? For categories, here's an example of jewelry. You have jewelry. What category can we put that in? And then as well, Here's an example for synonyms. This is an example for little. Of course, the synonym for that word is going to be small. Uh, it's a simple game, but it's a very fun, fast-paced, and active game. We have six different cars that the students can choose from. Uh, one's purple, red, orange, green, yellow, and of course the blue one here. And like I said, the students get to choose their car. They are working on their uh, language activity that they are focusing on, and as well, they're having fun delivering pizzas, and not only delivering pizzas, but collecting those super dough dollars as well. Go for the Dough is going to include a 16 by 16 inch game board, 480 super dough dollars, six pawns, die, and suggested answers. Uh, it's a fun game. Uh, it's a popular game. Uh, you too can have a lot of fun with your students playing this. Um, visit us at superduperinc.com to learn more about this game as well as others. And uh, also, you may visit us on Facebook and share your ideas on how you use this game in your therapy.